Trevor Noah says HES particularly impressed at how Fox News Channel has been handling the Harvey Weinstein scandal story. As horrible as the story is, the silver lining is everyone is finally talking about how serious the problem of sexual harassment is, Noah said. He singled out Fox News for taking such a strong stand, though he confessed he was a little confused, especially after this weekend. That's when NYT reported that, while still a Fox News Channel star, Bill O'Reilly reportedly paid $32 million in a settlement with longtime Fox News legal analyst Lee Sweel. One month later, 21st Century Fox resigned the host to a four-year $100 million contract. I'm still blown away O'Reilly had to pay one woman $32 million. Now I understand why he cranks out so many books, Noah said. Noting NYT reported Fox was aware of the settlement when it extended O'Reilly's contract, Noah called Ibaldi how the news network attacked other news orgs on the Weinstein story, throwing to clips of Tucker Carlson and Sean Hannity reporting on NBC's foot dragging with Ronan Farrow's Weinstein report, and a claim the New York Times had spiked an earlier Weinstein report. There is no faster way to get Fox to care about something than to tell them a powerful liberal hard on it, Noah snarked suggesting someone tell Fox News that Weinstein colluded with the Russians. And, while Hollywood has, at long last, tossed out Weinstein, six months after firing O'Reilly, Fox News Channel invited him back on its primetime air, to plug his new book. Does liberal Hollywood have a problem with sexual predators? Yes, Noah said. Does conservative Fox News have the same problem? Yes. It's not supposed to be partisan. Everyone has an issue Wall Street, Silicon Valley, construction sites, basically every place that has men, Noah said. And Fox was right to call it out. Not because they can score political points, but because it's the right thing to do. So, Fox News, please keep going after sexual harasses. I applaud you. And the great news is, you don't even have to leave the building.